Eli Hawk Moskowitz is a main character in Cobra Kai. Initially, a quiet and bullied victim, he gains confidence after joining the Cobra Kai dojo and becoming a star student, alongside Miguel. However, he is quickly corrupted by Cobra Kai's ruthless mentality, which makes him aggressive, ruthless, and a flat-out bully. He arguably becomes worse than the people that bullied him. Despite turning for the worst, Hawk's conscience eventually begins to return, which causes him to question his and Cobra Kai's antics. During the brawl at the LaRusso household, Hawk finally realizes the errors in his ways, which prompts him to turn against Cobra Kai and side with Miyagi-Do Karate and Eagle Fong Karate, as well as reconcile with his former friends he lost during his time at Cobra Kai. Eli was born with a cleft lip, which when surgically repaired resulted in a scar running from lip to nose. At some point prior to the events of Cobra Kai, he meets Dimitri, and the two become best friends. Eli was a fan of Harry Potter and Doctor Who, which Dimitri similarly enjoyed. Eli was often bullied because of his surgical scar. Eli was even a quiet individual according to Dimitri. At first Eli is quiet and shy, and he is often made fun of for his scar, the result of the repair of a cleft lip. Season 1. Miguel meets Dimitri and Eli at lunch when looking for a place to sit, which he finds with them due to them also being unpopular. The three are picked on by Kyler and his friends. After Miguel beats up Kyler and his friends, both Dimitri and Eli join the Cobra Kai dojo. At the dojo, Sensei Johnny Lawrence mocks Eli's lip even when Dimitri, and then Eli, tells him to stop. Johnny then tells Eli to flip the script in order to stop the others from making fun of him. Eli then leaves, possibly quitting, which visibly disconcerts Johnny, but he uses Eli's leaving as an example of weakness. The next day, however, Eli returns with a new style and a mohawk and says he has flipped the script, which impresses Johnny. From then on, Eli goes by Hawk. He even has a Hawk tattoo on his back that his parents aren't supposed to know about. The change in looks reflects a change in personality, as he goes from being shy, scared and insecure to overconfident, over-the-top, aggressive, and hot-headed. In a way he turns into Dutch and Bobby Brown, Johnny's friends at Cobra Kai when they were students at the old Cobra Kai dojo, run by Kreese. He turns a little bit into Bobby as he becomes the second best Cobra Kai student, inferior only to Miguel. Bobby was inferior only to Johnny. However, he is not too much like Bobby as Bobby does know a lot about his limits and even shows sympathy and is not reckless, while Hawk's personality is almost the exact opposite, as Hawk is reckless, can be extremely harsh and severe, while also showing no remorse in the end to a fight that he has won, until season 3, when he broke Dimitri's arm. His new look and personality causes Moon, who used to bully him with the other popular students for his scar, to become attracted to him. The two kiss and supposedly become a couple at the lake party the Cobra Kai set up to mess with Yasmin and Kyler. At the All-Valley Tournament, Hawk slash Eli reaches the semifinals where he faces Johnny's son Robbie Keen. He wins the first point against Robbie, but loses the second. After losing the second point, Hawk taunts Robbie, and in response Robbie mocks Hawk's mohawk, which infuriates Hawk and causes him to kick Robbie from behind in the shoulder, thus dislocating it and causing Hawk to get disqualified from the tournament. Following Hawk's disqualification, an upset Johnny asks him why he did what he did. But Hawk angrily defends his action, and he shows no remorse. After Miguel wins the tournament for Cobra Kai, Hawk and the others cheer for him, but Johnny was in no mood to celebrate. Season 2 Following Miguel's victory in the All-Valley Tournament, Hawk along with Miguel, Aisha, Moon and Dimitri celebrate. The following morning, however, Hawk and Miguel are forced by Johnny to do 50 push-ups because of their unsportsmanlike behavior against Robbie in the tournament. After some time, Miguel finds out that Robbie is Johnny's son, and he tells Hawk, causing them both to believe the only reason Johnny is being hard on them because they attacked his son. When they confront Johnny, an angry Johnny tells them that despite Robbie being his son, he doesn't tolerate unethical behavior. He also tells them to mind their own business. Over the course of the season, Hawk becomes a flat-out bully, intimidating and insulting new students of the dojo, and bullying Dimitri after the latter writes a bad review about Cobra Kai. When Dimitri is at the comic store in the mall, Hawk and some of his fellow Cobra Kai classmates corner him, and Hawk threatens Dimitri trying to force him to take down his Yelp review about Cobra Kai. When Dimitri refuses, Hawk attacks him. Dimitri then runs away, but Hawk and his gang corner him. Hawk is about to attack him again, but Robbie and Samantha arrive. Hawk and his gang fight them, but Hawk is beaten by Robbie, and the rest of the gang is bested as well. Later, Hawk's behavior has even more repercussions as Moon, his girlfriend, points out to Hawk that she likes his new attitude and style but not his bullying, and so she dumps him. Furious over the breakup, Hawk takes his anger out on a punching bag. Johnny's sensei, Kreese, then uses Hawk's anger against him by manipulating him into behaving more aggressively. Encouraged by Kreese and without Johnny's knowledge, Hawk leads a small group of Cobra Kai students, not including Miguel, 
to vandalize and destroy Daniel LaRusso's dojo, and Hawk steals the Medal of Honor which belonged to Daniel Sensei Mr. Miyagi. When Johnny finds out about this, he doesn't know who was responsible, and so he collectively punishes the dojo with endless exercises. Hawk is ready to come clean, but Kreis secretly tells him not to. Later during one of their training exercises, Miguel notices Hawk with the Medal of Honor and realizes Hawk is the one who destroyed Daniel's dojo. Miguel confronts Hawk, who then challenges Miguel to fight him for it. Despite putting up a good fight, Hawk is defeated by Miguel. Miguel then takes the Medal of Honor and later brings it to the LaRusso house. Although he wanted to give it to Sam, Robbie is there, so he gives it to Robbie explains he had no part in the destruction of Miyagi-Do. Surprisingly, Hawk is not angry at Miguel after this fight and the loss, sensing that the fight was fair and square. On the last day of summer, Hawk is at the party at Moon's house, where he tries to win her back by flirting with another girl. Moon interrupts their flirting and kisses the girl, revealing that they are dating. This upsets Hawk, of which Dimitri gets the effects. Dimitri comes and they manage to briefly bond over Doctor Who. But after Dimitri suggests he have inner peace, Hawk responds by pouring beer on Dimitri's head. Later at the party, Dimitri gets revenge by telling a large group of the partygoers embarrassing stories about Hawk. An enraged Hawk tries to attack him, but the cops arrive. In their attempts to not get caught, Hawk runs into Dimitri and threateningly reminds him they'll see each other the next day at school. During the fight that breaks out as a result of Tori's attacking Sam, Hawk gladly participates in the school brawl. He fights and beats several Miyagi-Do students before chasing Dimitri. Eventually he catches Dimitri and starts attacking him, but Dimitri defends himself with Daniel's Miyagi-Do karate teachings and manages to beat Hawk. Hawk is there in the aftermath when Miguel is lying unconscious on the steps. In one of the last scenes back at the Cobra Kai dojo, Hawk, along with Tori, Raymond, Mitch and some other students, are training with Kreese. When Johnny comes to the dojo, Kreese reveals he now owns the dojo. Johnny accuses the students of abandoning him, only for Hawk to blame him for Miguel's injuries. Season 3 In one of the first training exercises with the new dojo master, Kreese, the students are supposed to say whether they are uncomfortable feeding a mouse to a snake. Hawk is among the handful that don't raise their hands, but he is surprised and uncomfortable when Kreese dismisses the students who objected, kicking them out of Cobra Kai. Hawk asks Kreese if this is the right time to make cuts, since they already lost a few students as a result of the school fight. But Kreese sees this display of possible compassion as a weakness, which Hawk is quick to deny. After finding out that the Miyagi-Do students are hosting a fundraiser for Miguel's surgery, Hawk sees this as an affront against Cobra Kai and vows they won't get away with this. At the end of the day in Miyagi-Do's successful fundraiser, Hawk, Mitch and two other Cobra Kai students corner Nathaniel, who is responsible for the donations for Miguel's surgery, beat him up and take the money. Mitch does say they plan on giving it to Miguel's family themselves. The rivalry between Cobra Kai and Miyagi-Do, largely sustained by Hawk, continues at school. Hawk destroys Dimitri's science project but Dimitri cannot retaliate due to the new anti-fighting policies at the school. Recognizing this, the two dojos find other ways of acting out their rivalry. During a gym class soccer game, the Miyagi-Dos and Cobra Kai get physical, with Dimitri pushing and leg-sweeping Hawk as revenge, and Hawk getting back by headbutting Dimitri. Hawk also kicks the soccer ball at a Miyagi-Do student's face. When the game is interrupted and both sides are sent to the counselor's office for disciplining, Hawk, who was allowed to tell their side first, gets himself and his friends off without punishment with a fake, docile, and apologetic demeanor, while Sam, Dimitri, and the other Miyagi dos involved get detention. This isn't the end, as shortly thereafter, Hawk, Mitch, and some other Cobra Kais cause havoc in the arcade and harass Chris at work. He calls Sam, who then recruits some of the Miyagi dos to stop them, resulting in a fight. Initially, Hawk is losing to Sam, and the Miyagi dos have the edge. However, when Tori arrives with Big Red and Edwin, Cobra Kai gains the edge. After pinning Dimitri to the ground, the other Cobra Kais tell Hawk to break his arm, while Dimitri pleads him not to. After momentarily hesitating, Hawk breaks Dimitri's arm, but shows some discomfort while Dimitri screams in pain. The following morning, before class, at Cobra Kai, Hawk shows some discomfort and uneasiness when Mitch brags about Hawk breaking Dimitri's arm, but then Hawk says Miyagi do got what they deserved, likely to look tough in front of his friends. However, after noticing his former bullies Kyler and Brooks joining Cobra Kai, Hawk becomes angry and tells Kreese they aren't Cobra Kai material, but Kreese says they are natural athletes. When Kyler and Brooks encounter Hawk, they make fun of him, much like old times, which makes Hawk become Eli again for some time. Mitch then loses to Kyler in a sparing match, causing Kreese to kick him out of the dojo. While Hawk objects, pointing out how loyal Mitch has been, Kreese still kicks him out for not being Cobra Kai material. When it is Brooks' turn to fight, Hawk says he will fight him, and Kreese, seeing Hawk's taste for revenge, 
indicates the match won't run by the normal, fair rules of competition. Brooks mockingly says he will fix Hawk's lip, but Hawk lets him see his Hawk tattoo and shows he is unbothered, as Brooks and Kyler become uneasy. Hawk then aggressively easily beats Brooke in competition, and doesn't stop, even when Brooks begs him to stop, and is on the ground, seemingly letting out the pent-up emotions of his past bullying. In the end of the fight, Brooks is groaning in pain. Hawk glares at Kyler after beating Brooks, frightening the latter. After Miguel returns to school, Hawk greets him and things seem to continue like before. However, their friend group dynamics are changed as Hawk is quick to mock Mitch when they meet in the cafeteria, and tells him to sit at the loser's table. Then, Hawk is confronted by Miguel for breaking Dimitri's arm and going against their sensei. Hawk argues that Johnny is the one who betrayed them, and that he is no longer their sensei. This upsets Miguel, who tells Hawk he is letting Kreese take over his mind. Hawk is then shocked to learn from Miguel that Johnny has started a new dojo. Miguel tries to persuade Hawk to join. When Johnny shows up at school later that day, he approaches Hawk and some of the Cobra Kais, and he acknowledges his mistakes. However, Hawk criticizes Johnny for quitting and going soft on them, which causes an angry Johnny to remind Hawk that he, not Kreese, is the reason that Hawk went from being a weakling to a tough guy. He then tells them that Kreese doesn't care about them, and that they should come to his dojo tomorrow. The following morning, when Johnny's students are training, Hawk shows up with the other Cobra Kais. After initially thinking they are going to join Johnny's new dojo, Kreese also appears and Hawk reminds Johnny that he is Cobra Kai for life. Things are tense for a moment until the Cobra Kais leave, but this is where it becomes clear that Hawk's and Miguel's friendship is over. However, Hawk still seems to care about Miguel, since he is upset to find out that Robbie has joined Cobra Kai, which is problematic because of what he did to Miguel. Still, Hawk wants to please Kreese as the new sensei, and so he, along with some of the Cobra Kais, sets up a plan to sneak into the zoo and steal a snake for Kreese. When Robbie arrives, Hawk is angry that he was invited by Tori, but Tori challenges Hawk having a problem with Robbie being on the mission. When Hawk aborts the mission because Kyler forgot the snake pole, Robbie ends up getting the snake with his bare hands. Hawk is still not pleased about Robbie being on their team. That night after bringing the snake, Kreese reveals to them all that Miguel and Sam are now working together. Kreese orders the members to go and attack the Eagle Fangs slash Miyagi Dos. Then on that same night, when the Miyagi Dos and Eagle Fangs had just agreed to work together at Sam's house, Hawk and seven other Cobra Kai show up and attack them. Hawk spends a lot of time fighting Miyagi Do student Steven. While Steven puts up a fight and gets some hits, Hawk has the upper hand overall and beats him. However, after noticing Miguel, Mitch and the other Miyagi Do's being beaten up by the other Cobra Kai students, he shows shows discomfort and uneasiness, remembers what Johnny and Miguel said at school, and also remembers what Chris said about enemies. After this, he sees Doug holding Dimitri's arm. Doug encourages him to break his arm a second time. Hawk runs up, but knocks down both Doug and the other Cobra Kai, and saves Dimitri. After saving Dimitri, he apologizes to Dimitri for everything, resulting in their friendship being rekindled. The two then work together to defeat several Cobra Kais. After defeating the Cobra Kais in Sam's house, Hawk heads to Daniel's home dojo by the pool along with Miguel and Dimitri, where they see Tori, who was just disarmed by Sam. Hawk tells Tori the fight is over, but she refuses to believe it's over. She leaves, but not before telling Hawk to watch his back. Dimitri promises that Hawk's friends will watch it for him. The following morning, the last scene of this season shows Hawk going with some of the other former Cobra Kais to Miyagi-Do, where he high-fives Dimitri, and trains with the Miyagi-Do and Eagle Fong students under Johnny and Daniel's leadership.